Hello, Leah. Welcome to Truth Well Told. Tarot, this is Andrea, and I'm here to do your love reading. And it will be for May 2021, or now to the end of May 2021, as I am releasing these a little bit early, for the sign of Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So I hope you well. Let's get straight into your reading and pull your overarching energy in terms of love, romance, relationships. Remember, the message will be what it will be, Leo. So, you know, we'll just... Uh, see what happens so what do we have for leo please angels spirits guides message for leo so i'm getting clarity about your future because we have the crystal ball here someone's getting clarity about their future so i'm going to pull three cards and then we'll clarify go deeper into the message and it won't resonate with everybody so just take what resonates with you leo as always okay so what do we have in terms of love romance relationships for leo please for from now to the end of may 2021 please for our lovely leos i'm using the tarot grand lux so we've got queen of coins in the challenge position advice from spirit justice and the page of cups okay So what do we have for Leo, please? Can we clarify the cards on the table for Leo? Yeah, I'm using the Tarot Grand Lux and this is the Tarot of Dreams. Okay. Okay, let's clarify these cards. Love, romance, relationships for Leo, please. May 2021. It's interesting because I've got uh, it kind of came out more reversed there, so I'm just putting that down. Um, justice, and we have with the Emperor. We have the Three of Coins and the Nine of Wands. Okay, 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 okay. I, I'm definitely getting this energy. Um, uh, both of these cards together can mean the legal situation, legal systems. So some of you are feeling with some dealing with some kind of legal system and you're waiting for clarity on this situation here, Leo. Because it feels whatever this decision is that's coming your way is, is, is going to affect... It feels that there's some monetary requirement here. Maybe some payout or award that you're hoping for or waiting for. I mean, generally when the justice card appears in your reading, it's a sign of truth is on your side, fairness. They can represent a legal decision, you know, government institution, if there's legal proceedings or disputes. A decision will be in the light of truth that will restore balance to the situation. You know, and we have the Emperor, which is, you know, it can be to do with these, I mean, the, these two cards together, it feels like the legal system. But, you know, the Emperor on its own is about taking authority, taking charge. You might be dealing with an Emperor as well, which can be more of a masculine energy. Uh, we have Libra and Aries here, for those of you it might resonate with. But it feels in this energy, I mean, the Emperor generally is an energy of taking control, taking charge. But it feels to do with that, more to do with some kind of legal establishment that you're dealing with. Truth will out, that is for sure. And there's complete impartiality. There's absolutely a feeling of... It feels like balance will be restored. Because we have the Queen of Pentacles upright and she kind of came out more reversed, which is an interesting one. Now, generally, um, this is Capricorn for me as a reader, though this could be you in terms of what you're feeling in terms of the energies here. I mean, firstly, she's a card of nurturing energy. Um, she is a healing energy and nurturing energy, very much about taking care of your health, uh, your practical, you know, uh, surroundings. So, you know, making sure she can provide financially for herself, a working parent, 
doing the practical things, you know, focusing on money, career, finances, uh, the practical things that she needs to do to take care of what matters to her the most, what's of value to her the most. She can represent somebody offering you something as well. The Queen can offer that pentacle energy too. It feels in this situation, you're worried about it feels, it feels in this situation, one, there's a kind of worry about providing financially for yourself. And I'm definitely getting this energy of maybe waiting for some payout here. I'm definitely getting some kind of legal payout. Um, there's a real kind of energy of financial independence. You might have gone through some separation from in a relationship and you're waiting for some kind of payout. Well, there's definitely an energy at the end of this reading here. It has been a difficult journey. You know, it certainly tested your faith, Leo, but it feels like there's one thing to go, one I to dot, one T to cross, um, one hurdle to overcome. And then it feels in the situation that the, the situation is completed. But this has been a difficult journey, a test of faith. Uh, it's the wounded warrior energy. This has been so difficult. I'm getting to that. I'm finally one wand away from a completion, which is this. The nine being one wand away from the ten, which is completion in the major arcana. And it feels in this situation that it's been a difficult journey. It's really tested your resilience, your energy, your drive. However, it feels, I mean, the page of cups is generally an energy of things looking up. Um... You know, it's, it's a fun energy. It's an innocent energy with the Page of Cups as well. You, you know, it might also be for some of you that Three of Coins can be the beginnings of success or rebuilding your life with a child. So whatever resonates with you here, but there's definitely an energy of things are looking up. You know, the pages are also messengers. So it feels like for some of you, there could be some positive news um, or it feels like there's one hurdle to overcome and then you're ready to focus on manifesting this new path you know the three of coins is essentially the beginnings of success and it can well be about new path you could be moving home you could be doing up a home with the three of pentacles it can be about new jobs so certainly this page of cups could be some offer or something coming your way that allows things to look up for you maybe in terms of jobs money security um we might well be in this energy there's some positive news coming your way it feels leo that will allow you to rebuild your life you know and this is the beginnings of success the three of coins it's the beginnings of building something new um whether it's to do with money career a home a property or life you know building your life back up because the pentacles is what brings stability and security to our lives the page can also be an offer of love a loving gesture a loving gift it, it feels in this situation whatever resonates for you you've tr you've trodden a difficult path but there's this beautiful kind of like the beginnings of new success coming your way. So whatever decision is made here, it feels it will allow you to provide financially for yourself, maybe to put a deposit on a home for some of you, um, or to start rebuilding your life. And there's a feeling of there's just one more thing to do. And it feels very imminent because you're going to get the clarity that you need about your future. So it feels like whatever decision it feels like a legal decision. It feels like you're waiting on some kind of legal decision. And then, bam, that is the beginnings of new success in your life, however it resonates for you. I mean, the cards remain the same, but remember, the pentacles energy is what's stable and secure in our lives. So it can be to do with our home, our property, our health, our finances. It can be to do with foundational relationships. But certainly, whatever this is, Leo, it feels like you're just one step away. You're very, very close. And then it feels like there is something good happening that raises your spirits. Things are about to lock up. So I'm going to pull... Let's pull one card for this Page of Cups. Let's pull one card for this Page of Cups, please, Angel Spirits Guides. 
for our lovely Leos, thank you, to do with this reading. There's too many there. I've got about six cards there. I just want one card, please, Angel Spirits Guides. Thank you. Well, we've got Leo, which is nice. Oh, news. Yeah, so it's news. It's news. So we have some good news. Um, and it's you, Leo. I like the fact that you're appearing in your reading. So you're finally receiving good news. It feels to do with a legal system, legal situation here, establishment. And there is the new beginning opening up for you, the beginning of success, the beginning of rebuilding your life. It feels like there's a release energy. And you know what I love about this, Leo? I love about this. This is the final wand, the completion, the final, wow, I can release. I'm a free spirit from this situation. I'm being liberated and I can start focusing on building my life back up. However, that resonates for you, money, career, moving home, uh, doing up your property, rebuilding your life, call it what you will. But it feels a very beautiful energy for some of you. I like the good news energy between these two cards. I, I felt the good energy. Things are looking up. Um, but you might have had to be strong for children as well. You know, I will I will throw that in there as well because, you know, I'm feeling children for some of you as well. That's what the Queen does very well. She's male or female energy, but there's a protection energy that goes with this. Um, I want to protect financially. I want to provide a home. You know, I want to provide material security. I want to nurture. You know, I want to bring growth. You know, it's all this kind of energy that that's what the Queen of Pentacles does. But this is you being in your power, absolutely being in your power. There's a resoluteness, there's a determination because you want to do that. Because you will face your fear and challenge and overcome it. Because that's what this queen wants to do. You know, um, she will overcome the challenge because it might well be there's other people that she has to care about as well. Um, or certainly material aspects that she wants to worry about. So it, it feels very beautiful, Leo. Um, I'm going to pull you a final card. It feels you'll get clarity on a legal dispute. And it will allow you to rebuild beautifully. There's good news. Yeah, we have whale tenderness show compassion and forgive what needs to be forgiven that could be whether that's with yourself or somebody else sometimes we need to forgive ourselves and let ourselves move on it's how we don't carry toxic energy with us and yeah you know i knew that was going to come out the snake which is about shedding an old skin so the snake kundalini rising channel your creative passion and sensuality welcome the transformation I'm definitely getting this release energy, release liberation energy, good news. And it's to do with some kind of legal decision that you've been waiting for. You're going to get clarity on it and that will open up your future. You know, I love this energy, Leo. I mean, it doesn't feel like it's been completely easy, but it feels like it's, it's nearly over. And that's the good thing that you need to know. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful month for you all and I will see you next time. Thank you.